South Wales. I was going to get a bit of footage when I left, but when I left it was actually dark. A bit sleepy, been on the go for about two hours now. And I'm going, well, it's going to be a good weekend for the grommets. Got all my toys. We've got boats, surfboards, skateboards, a little bit of rum, I'd imagine. Yeah, it should be good. I hope Pat has a beer waiting for me. I'm already getting a bit thirsty. Well, thank you to Andrew for doing our intro for what will be part one and part two of the Bulls Regatta. This weekend, Totally Immersed TV will be bringing you all the action behind the scenes and both on the water for the annual Bullets Regatta at the Palm Beach Sailing Club. Now, I'm Paddy, behind the camera is Carmen, and we are now inbound to Pittwater for what will be an excellent weekend, both on and off the water. Oh, there's Jimmy and Glenn, to the horn. <laughs> all right, let's kick it a ripper. Haven't even left Jervis Bay, and we've already hidden traffic. How's your drive? Very steady, very cruisy. Kicked your ass. Woo Is the shirt small enough? It's a muscle shirt. On location? Oh. How's the drive? Clean. Did you go to Spain? No. How's your drive? Uh, quite relaxing. Nothing exciting. Usually it's in the middle lane, but anyway, other than that, well, saw you Aussies out one day. It's Oz Music t-shirt day today. Who are you wearing? Bad dreams. It's rock and roll, got midnight oil on from the last tour. So describe Palm Beach, what does it look like as we walk down here to the shoreline? It looks good. Picturesque or what? Yes. What's the window on? Hmm. How would you describe it? On shore maybe? Yes. Look at this. I'm blowing. Hello mate. Hello mate. <laughs> Who are you wearing today? Mid and all, obviously. Jimmy. Are you going to go out now? I wasn't playing with Jimmy. It's windy, you can see it. What's going on? Um, no, I'm not just because How's your drive? Quick clip off here. Pretty good? Yeah. What are we doing here? Oh, yeah. uh, I'm tying the riding line so we can put some extra weight on. We saw a guy par wait, is paragliding, is that what it's called? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he's a good boy, look at him! Oh, <laughs> he's right mind, just goes to a quick Let's go! Oh! 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 The boys are back yeah. together! What's up? <laughs> Double wise, mate. Double what wise. You, what are you sailing this weekend? <laughs> Ooh! I'm gonna attack my dog. <laughs> Dolomite. Not dog yet. Yeah, Ooh. Fuck. Stop it. How was it out there? Pathetic. Bit off it. Ten attempts to undo the traveller. Ten. It was flagging like. Real live was bag. No good. Bit off the ball. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Broke it already twice. Broken at the top till the carabiner opens on the downhaul. Don't make them like they used to. Is that why you go out the day before? Could be. Break yeah. the things that Didn't break, break the crew. That's the main thing. Oh, it's good. A bit pissed at the pub. A little, little bit. A respectable amount of pissed at the pub. Oh, I had a dinner, which was way too expensive. Now I go on the Mackenzie's to annoy them. What are you doing? Not much. What have you been up to? What do you got here? It's no Commodore. Oh, I didn't bring chairs. Yeah, yeah, thank you. We're having a conference. Hello, Deb. Oh, hello. Hello. Hello, Patrick. Oh, Andrew, for Totally Immersed TV. How are you going? How are you? Good. Uh, we had chicken, salads. Wasn't too bad. Yeah, nice. No How was the pub? I was, it was actually a bit average to be honest. There wasn't, wasn't many people there, but yeah. this looks like not nice. Chicken Avo. Oh, my boy. First time appearance on Tally Merce TV. Just like. The boy, can you give us a room tour? Of the trip in. Your dad did one, so now you have to do one as well. I can do one later. We're just doing a bit of a setup, a bit of arrangement, trying to dry out the bed. Got a bit of dew on it because we left the bed out in the rat, out in the dew. So we might be doing a bit of heating and hopefully dry it out. Oh, I'm just talking about the bunting and the fairy lights. How beautiful are the bunting? Yeah, Beck would be proud of you. Beck would be proud. My sister made the bunting. Rebecca is probably responsible for the fairy lights. <laughs> Went down to the cafe, got a cup of feed, checked out the surfers. Any surf? Fair bit. Did you go out? No. Why not? No one woke me up. You said you were, but. Well, I had a very nice sleep in, whereas you. Well, lazy uh, boy. Look, so we didn't have much of a closer last night because we were running Mark, had a couple of Bruskins, sort of went to bed semi early. But we're on the road now, running 15, 20 minutes late. Nothing like running a little bit late. That's Pat's fault. A, uh, Hobie regatta. But um, no, we're off now. It's looking like a pretty good day. 15, 20 knot nor'easter. Oh, local game of cricket. 
It's getting time to go to work and get into it. What have you got to say, Pelican? Turn the camera around. Forecast looks pretty good. Brand new sail. What do you think, Carmen? You came for this new sail? Pretty keen, pretty keen. It's got her bands in it, though, so you know. Yes, it has. Yeah, it does. It's got your bands. Oh, yes. Yeah. Still gonna be no match for Ellie and I on Manyanga. Sorry about her. <laughs> oh, big talks. That is big talk, <laughs> isn't it? Day one, haven't even started racing and they're chatting themselves up. Sorry about it. What are we up to today? Um, cheer squad, food supply, sunshade. Yeah, the mast is supposed to go up, Macca. <laughs> so we're registering for our first state titles. How are we prepping so far? Pretty good. Bad, eh? Boat, up the boat. Any little errors with the boat so far or is she all good? Nice. Pristine. Perla, mate. We gotta register and look at the racetrack and do all that fun stuff. Anything you wanna say? Not really. Yeah, fair enough. What do we get for registering, Carmen? A mug, apparently. Copy I mug. Just copped yeah, no. Bro. What team are we, Carmen? Are we Team Andrews or Team Pelican? Well, I mean, Andrews works. We're not on Team Pelican boat. But the Pelican is here, though. It's... We gotta figure that out. Pat, are we Team Pelican or Team Andrews? What do you reckon? Well, you're, you're always a Pelican in my eyes, but. Probably Team Andrews today, bloke. There's Andrew and Alan. There you go. Team Andrews, it's sorted. What you got, bloke? It's gold. What's in there? A couple mugs for the rum or coffee. Cheers. You read the sailing instructions? Yeah. No, what are they? Yeah, I mean, I have no idea. What are they? Don't know. Ask some of these guys. You read the sailing instructions? Sailing instructions? No. Ellie, you read the sailing instructions? Never. <laughs> Mr. President, you read the sailing instructions? Yeah, mate. I uh, read them before I went to bed, and I read them before I woke up this morning. A few off for us. Yeah. Um, Any rules we should know? Or? We'll change from four maxes uh, per session to five because we're a bit worried about the um, Norwester tomorrow coming in and stirring things up. So trying to get five races done today, keep us safe, and then any course changes that you were worrying about, they'll talk about at briefing, Andrew Warnicky, which is why we're going to wait literally two more minutes. Thanks to the traditional custodians and elders, past, present, and emerging of this land, the Gurungai Nation, we recognise their knowledge and connection to country and most of all, the seas in which we live, learn and sail. Grover, you did. Thank you. So, welcome to Palm Beach on the Commodore. Uh, most of you know most of the members here anyway, being Hobart sailors, so it's great to have you all here. Um, Palm Beach Sailing Club is extremely happy to host events, and uh, and we really like to, to get them promoted in, in various media, media around the place. So.